Did you know that your engine's performance is heavily influenced by something called the compression ratio? But what exactly is it, and why is it so important? Let's break it down. The compression ratio is basically a comparison of two things. The volume of the cylinder when the piston is at the bottom versus the volume when it's at the top. In simpler terms, it tells us how much the air-fuel mixture gets compressed inside the cylinder before it ignites. For example, if the ratio is 10 to 1, that means the air-fuel mixture is compressed to one-tenth of its original volume. The higher the compression ratio, the more the air is squeezed and the more energy is released when it ignites. Why does this matter? Well, a higher compression ratio generally means more power and better fuel efficiency because the fuel burns more completely. However, it also increases the risk of knocking when the fuel ignites prematurely, causing engine damage. On the other hand, a lower compression ratio might be safer but tends to produce less power. So car manufacturers balance this ratio to get the best performance without sacrificing engine durability. Different engines use different compression ratios. For example, gasoline engines typically have ratios between 8 to 1 and 12 to 1. Diesel engines, however, have much higher ratios, around 15 to 1, 1 to 21, because they rely on compression ignition rather than spark plugs. So, now you know what the compression ratio is and why it's so important for your engine's performance. Got more questions about how engines work? Drop them in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more automotive tips.